I don't know what I'm gonna say this time. <laughs> What's going on YouTube? It's Noxo and we're back with kind of, kind of our reaction series. We're kind of back with some more Inception stuff today. So you guys have reached out to me. I've gotten DMs. I've had my phone blow up because apparently, apparently the lead singer, Ronnie Radke, Ronnie Radke, it's gotta be Ronnie Radke, right? Did I say that right? Anyways, the lead singer of Falling in Reverse reacted to my reaction of his song popular monster so naturally we're gonna we're gonna have to see what this is about man because it's not every day that you know you do a reaction to someone's music and they turn around and react to that so i'm interested to see you know if i got my breakdowns right if my analysis was good if he liked it maybe he trolls me maybe he doesn't like me i don't i honestly i i don't know what to expect but this is this is wild this is a new one man so we're gonna watch him watching me watching him do this yeah okay this makes sense let's dive into this ronnie radke falling in reverse step back up to the plate let's go i shoot it well it's a very good day who is this see ghosts Ghost is out of quarantine. What a crazy quarantine that was for him. So, your boy is back. Obviously, is this loud enough? It doesn't. <laughs> yeah, I love that beginning. Who is this? Who is this? Who is this dude with the hat and the weird eye behind him? And what a cool setup, like a green screen setup, because he can get up, he can walk around and do his thing, and then we've just got focus on me behind him, which is kind of. Uh, Definitely Inception like surreal here because I'm watching him watch me watch him. Where does it end? Social Sorry guys if this right isn't loud enough. I don't think I can get any louder. Commenting on that's watching me, so now it's quiet on my end. Is that my settings? Do you guys think my videos are kind of low? Got to turn it up. Comment know. below. What's going I, I need on to know YouTube that actually. It's Noxil and we're back with our reaction oh. series. So today, 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 man, today is a very, is cringe. very special day. Because we're going to do a non-rap song. That's right. I know I'm a rapper. I know that we do. I love how he's giving me his here, full attention. That's cool. We have a song and an artist that you guys recommend that has been highly this is, requested. This is fucking crazy. This is pretty damn crazy. Because I spend so much time dissecting the artist. And man, I really, really love that song. I can't speak highly enough of it. Like just the different genres that it blends, his talent rapping, his talent singing, his talent screaming. Man, I mean, th th this is a big band. This is a big artist right here that I've taken the time to react to. And now all of a sudden he's going to return that and take time reacting to me. I mean, yeah, there's going to be some people that are like, oh, look, Knox is just celebrating himself and how great he is. It's like a big circle jerk. Okay. Okay. Thanks, guys. Please make sure that you return mom's iPad by 9 o'clock tonight because it'll be past your bedtime. Anyways, man, I just, it's its very rewarding. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. This is this is really cool that an artist is taking the time to show love back and to give some appreciation back. Well, hopefully. We don't know. He might troll me. He might hate it. Want me wow, that means I'm a famous. About the band <laughs> in reverse. So today's song that we're going to hop into is called Popular Monster. It's one of their most successful songs. Apparently, this, it's a crazy music video. Is this you guy famous or like a big deal? I don't know. I need to no. Give some light to it and break no, it not at all. Down. But real quick, before we go any further, guys, if you guys like this. Definitely, definitely nowhere near your level there, bud. Sure, I have 100,000 subscribers, but in today's age, that doesn't, that doesn't mean anything, honestly. It means a lot to me. Thank you guys for loving me and supporting me, but that doesn't make me famous by any level. Like you guys sharing comments with me and going, "Oh, you're so famous." No, no, I'm not. I'm just, I'm just a human being. I'm a, I'm a person that stands in front of a camera sometimes. In the intro, then check it out. The link will be below. He, fu he fucks with Eminem, I've noticed, which means uh, he, I fuck with him. Oh yes. Involved, you fuck with them, I fuck with you. You but fuck anyways, with me, I fuck with you. I fuck with Eminem too. Falling in reverse. This is gonna be interesting. Come on, Knox, get into it. Jesus Christ, how long are we gonna sit here and do this? God, my hair got so long. These bro. intros so take fuck. forever. It's just wild right now, huh? Gotta listen closely, guys. It's really quiet over here. I can't do anything Why about is it. Why it so quiet? Yeah. Is that me? 
Oh. What a way to start the song in video. You just have this distortion that just rocks the headphones. That's it, right? And it's all This black. is so weird watching me. And then slowly we reveal the scene as the camera slides forward and you see all of this trail of destruction and these dead bodies everywhere in this courtroom. And then the beat starts to build. Does he have like ADD? He's got to, because he's like, he's pacing. Oh, he's funny. He's back and forth. Oh, I got a compliment. He's funny. I wake up every morning with my head up in a daze. I'm not sure if I should say this. Fuck, I'll say it anyway. Everybody tries to tell me that I'm going through a phase. I don't know if it's a phase. I just want to feel okay. Yeah. Yo, I love that delivery, man, because he stood there and there's no movement really yes exactly he's like this guy fucks he gets it less. he's just laid back with his delivery he's got a deep it's like a rap awake singing voice yep. you know, i wake up every morning, morning with my head up in a daze <laughs> nice delivery nice cadence on that wake up every morning with my head up in a daze thank god i got those lyrics right phase. i don't know if it's a phase i just want to feel okay yeah. i don't know if it's a phase i just want to feel okay I like those Come on, Knox. I want to rock out. Let it play. Deep and raw, and then you've Dickhead. got just these terrible, gruesome. It's so quiet. Company it. Fuck. Wow. Hold on, guys. Let me try to fix it, bro. Oh. Oh. I'll try to fix oh, it, no. man. Sorry. Editor. Jk, that's that's actually me editing my videos. Hey, uh, future Knox. Let's just let's fast forward this. We're we're not gonna have a problem anymore. There we go. All right. Game time. Kobe. Oh. Okay, yeah. Is that better? But the question still remains. That's the piece, Kobe. Was that yelling like the ad lib in the background? That was a little drop and it. Oh, hang on. Let me hear that again. I just wanna feel okay. Best I can do. That's the best I can do. I love this song, man. I've played this song so much since then. Traumatic stressing or am I suppressing rage? Listen to the internal rhyme schemes. He's not a rapper. He's not a rapper, but. He's rhyming like a rapper. No, I'm a and rapper. Depth of those lines. Is this post-traumatic stress all This man's all about to be fucking uh, it's so hit shocking. with the fucking uh, blood of Jesus now? Christ in a minute, bro. <laughs> have all these unresolved issues. Yo, I am. That's no lie, man, because this shit goes out. hard. This man has no idea, no, does he? No, I don't. Side, right? I really don't. I relate it to the name of the song. And I know that he's a rapper now, and you guys have suggested me check out one of his mixtapes where he is rapping. And I can tell, man. I said it's written with the internal schemes and you could tell that there's a depth to the lyrics that that a rapper knows and that a rapper recognizes like he's not a rapper he has no idea bro i'm about to hit him with bars wow listen to that drop man i love that and you hear how when the kicks happen like the camera jumped super quickly from just gruesome scene to gruesome scene to gruesome scene and then we cut in and with the break check this out Drink that Starbucks, baby. Load up. Uh. I mean, the thing is, though, he's, he's tuned in, man. Like, he's tuned in. He's, he's taking this all on board. This is fucking wild. Has just happened to my eardrums. Oh, we got a smile too. What a cool! I just made him smile. Man. I'll take that. I thought he was gonna keep building with sort of his rap voice, but man, we switched that up and we went into the rock vibe and we just totally changed genres and changed lanes right there. That's like some Linkin Park type of shit, man. That's cool. Oh my god, this guy's very out of touch. <laughs> oh, I am. That's like Linkin Park. Oh, I'm definitely bro, <laughs> bro. You can call me out on that shit. Like, I thought that afterwards when I was editing. Like, great. Great job, Knox. Like, the only reference that you can make is going all the way back to Linkin Park. Like, <laughs> it's true, though. It's true, though. Like, I need to dive more into this genre and more into the current and relevant artists of today because I'm definitely, I'm, I'm out of touch. I'm out of touch. me. <laughs> Love that job, man. <laughs> wow. I break.
break down trying to find a way out. I'm a liar. I'm a cheater. I'm a non-believer. I'm a popular monster. Because these, these different things, these are like the real life monsters, aren't they? Compared to like the werewolves and, and the, the monsters and the creatures that you see in films. Like he's today's monster. He's a liar. He's a cheater. I'm proud he's of this analysis. He's all these things that you slander him with. And yet here he is. Come on. Center stage. Come on. Tell me you like this. Monster with his demons. Tell me this is what you were thinking. Of his demons? I gave me chills. In the path of destruction that he's leaving in his wake. Because obviously there's something more that's implied here. Like you see the different people and their eyes lighting up like the monster that's inside each and every one of us. Maybe. Exactly. Monster, this man like, has some perspective. Heads. I love that. I don't know. That's kind of the vibe that I'm getting here. Yes. Like, You're right. He's the only yes. one that's alive in that courtroom. And he left all this. Let's go. Wake, and it's like he's almost coming to terms with that. And this. I mean, we, listen, guys. I sit here and I talk about these songs, and you guys look to it like I'm like genius or something. You know what I mean? Like I'm. I know I'm a bar breakdown channel, but listen, I'm. I'm like you. I'm hearing music for the first time. I'm interpreting it too in my mind. And music is subjective. So the thing is, I'm just giving you my interpretations of things. Right? These are not necessarily objective interpretations these are subjective interpretations these are my opinion on things and i'm just guessing what the artist is doing and trying to put myself in the mind of the artist so you know i don't fully know i really don't so to have an artist that i'm reacting to and try to break down and give analysis to for him to turn around and go you're right that's what i was thinking that's man that's big that's awesome song is coming to terms that's dope with that inner conflict and those demons this is so cool. So the uh, the courtroom where everybody's dead is an analogy for uh, my past uh, because we did Drug of Me as You in that same courtroom. Right. And it's almost like sh shedding a cocoon like a butterfly fucking come out, uh, coming out of like a new skin, like a snake coming out of his skin, and uh, you know what I mean? And a butterfly being formed into a butterfly, completely changing it. And it's like, um, it's like this is what you want. This is what you're going to get. You keep pushing. Yeah. You keep pushing me, man. You never you never back a wolf into a fucking corner because that wolf is going to fucking snap. Fucking facts. Huh. It's really interesting that that is symbolic of his past. See? So much deeper meaning and depth to the choice of the visuals, to the lyrics themselves. You could tell this guy, this guy has his own perspective. He thinks through things on a deeper level. What a great hook. Great falsetto. That falsetto, nice. Yep, I said it. Wow. I love that drop down. And all the instrumentation kicks out. So it's like it builds and it builds. And then we climax with the chorus and the hook. And then now we just... Oh, totally shit. Timer, down. guys. Kicked out the drums. Please. Kicked out the rest Save of the that bad boy for me, and then please. we start to let it rebuild again i think i'm going nowhere like a rat trapped in a maze every wall i love these I lines down, right here the wall that i replace i'm in a race against myself I try wow i love that too there's some really good depth to lyricism here. that's wild it, see that that was throwing me off a little bit earlier so whenever he gets a what a donation or a new uh subscriber like his noise that plays is the falling in reverse popular monster song itself that's, that's wild. Like a rat in a maze. Every wall that I knock down is just another that I replace. You know, this maze is within my mind. And even when I try to break through it and overcome these things, I just put more obstacles in the way. Exactly. Keep a steady yes. That I knock down is just Let's go. That I replace. I'm in a race against myself. I try to keep oh. a steady pace. I, if I, never close my case. I just, I, I, hey, that's just validates it, man. That's awesome. Oh, it's building. It's building again. And this little, like we're winding it up right now. And then it's so hard to watch myself. It is actually. More kicks I'm just trying to focus on him and not on me. Because watching me, there's stuff when I'm like, man, I wish I would have done this different. Or I wish I would have done that different. Oh, a nice mirroring of the lyrics. What, what was it before that I'm going through a phase, but it's not a fucking phase? And then this time, Tarn back. Be patient, bro. Let the guy fucking talk, man. That he's gone to. Like he's trying to get help. I can't see chat right help. now, so now I don't know what chat's help. saying. Oh, you're like bitching and complaining because he's pausing every second. Who fucking cares, bro? Relax, man. 
People don't do everything the way that you want them to, and that's okay. You need to accept the fact that people are different and they do things different. He's not, a, he's not annoying me. I mean, it is a little fucking weird that he keeps pausing it, but he's, at least he has like a he, his head on his shoulder. He's like fucking describing it and keeping me entertained. I don't, I mean, turn it off, bro. I'm sorry. Turn it off. Mental help. You can't figure <laughs> Fuck it. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. So he likes it so much that he's now defending me to one of his own fans and own followers who's complaining about it. <laughs> Let's fucking go. That's cool, man. And I see it. You know, I get some of the comments still. I do. There's people that come on here and we've done trolling the trolls. And you know, I have fun with them when it's like, man, you pause like every two, three seconds, bro. Like, just let the song play. Damn. Just let the song play. Well, I hate to break it to you, but if you want to listen to the song, then just go listen to the song. I'm, I'm a bar breakdown channel. We're going to break down bars. And, you know, this is my first time stepping outside of my box and doing a different genre. So I definitely didn't pause as much. This is only like a 14, 15 minute video compared to like my M videos, which are a half hour to 40 minutes. So I definitely didn't pause as much. But, you know, I'm going to apply that same analysis and that same sort of breaking down the lyrics, the mind of the artist, the instrumentation, the visuals, what goes into it, because that's that's what I do. And, you know, I do have over 100,000 subscribers now. So obviously I'm doing something right. Obviously you guys enjoy these types of breakdowns and what I'm doing. And if I was just like every other reaction channel and some of these bigger channels that just watch it and pause two or three times, would I be to the level that I'm at? I don't know. But that's not why I'm doing this. And that's not why you guys follow me. So, you know, to the new people who hate that I paused it so much, um, let me go get you a bag of troll food and uh, have fun underneath of your bridge because I really don't care. Figure out what's wrong with him. And his therapist is telling him, you know, that this is just a stage, just a stage of his crisis. And it's not a fucking stage. And you listen to that delivery and that angst in his voice. Here we go again. Love these drops, man. Oh. Wow. I just love the builds of the emotion and how we come out of the rap into the I'm rock. terrified. And, you know, man, that was powerful, man. Closer to the fucking grave. It's powerful. Oh. Yep, I'm terrified. Oh. Single fucking day, I get closer to the grave. I am terrified. Wow, yeah, look at I'm him. Terrified. Every look, look how we. Day I get closer. You see how even then, like I know he's kind of half-assing it in a sense because he's just repeating what he's doing. Like he's not actually performing it. If he was performing it, he'd super jump into it. But you could still see there's a little bit of the emotion there. Like when he did that terrified pantomime, you see his body language and he's like, oh, he's just ripping something to the grave. Like I feel the end coming. It's haunting me. These monsters in my head, and you see his eyes kind of light up as he's sitting back, like he's he's letting out his angst. This music is his outlet. This is his therapy session, and he's talking to us along with the therapist. And this drop, man, again, this transition from rap into like this is really cool. How he's just he's letting me talk, like he's not he's not stopping a lot. He's not talking over me. He's just letting me talk. And he's actually just sitting there and he's taking it in and he's listening to my analysis and he's letting his listeners listen to it. Wow. Huge respect for that. This heavy metal type of rock blend. This is cool. Hold on. Did you hear of Activision? No. What happened with Activision? Is there something I need to know about Activision? What happened to Activision? What's going on with Activision? What is going on with Activision? Because I have an Activision Call account. Just to feel again. Wow. Tell me what's happening. Break down. Yo. That was cool. A little bit of a plot happening in the visual story. Accounts right? being hacked at Activision? What? And then he realized that his therapist has been taking notes on him. Then he was on the phone and he was calling the people who were after him, the people who were trying to stop him. Activision accounts get hacked? from now. He's been double-crossed. Did Activision accounts get hacked? Somebody comment below. Monster. 
Wow. Here comes the falsetto again. Really? Beautiful. Man, he hits that falsetto so well. Popular fucking monster. At that point in the show, you just mosh pit. Like you go crazy when that part hits. Monster demonic voice behind him to accompany that killer. I dare you, bro. Man, you you're gonna drop a hunter bomb. I fucking dare you, killer. Let's go, bro. <laughs> like, <laughs> into some scream core type of shit. Hold on. <laughs> <sighs> okay. This Damn, is listen wild, to the man. kick of that drum. Tired of wandering. Oh, this is wild when he turned into a werewolf. You know what was cool, and you guys connected this, was um, I talked about the popular monster versus like the fictional monsters, you know, being a liar, a cheater, a non-believer, being those versions of monsters. And then I said, it's not like being like a werewolf or a creature like that. And actually I said werewolf before I watched him turn into a werewolf, which happens later and it's happening right now. This is such a cool scene, man. This is just crazy. Damn! Oh! Ah. What a crazy build and just to accompany the action and just him just ripping people apart, man. And that guitar is just taking shit to another level and everybody's just going ham on the instruments. He's a really cool. Damn, I like this guy. Follow this guy. His name's Knox Hill. All right. Let's go. So while you do that, That's cool, I need to man. change my Activision password real quick. Ah, so there was something with Activision. There was something with Activision. Oh, that's a shame, man. I would have liked him to see the end of the reaction in my final analysis. But, wow, I mean, he gave me enough camera time. I mean, he really was astute. Like, he sat there and he listened and let me talk. He took it on board. A fan was complaining. He defended me to that fan. And then at the end, he said, go follow this guy. Go check him out. I like him. Man, that is that is high compliments. That is that is just it's so cool because being a breakdown channel, man, these videos take a lot longer to do, right? They take a lot longer to edit, to upload, to tag, to do. You know, it's not like I just fly through these. You only get a handful a week and I only get so much time. So I have to be very selective in what I pick and what I invest my time in and what I do for you all to try to keep growing, but also to give you, you know, unique content and music with a substance. So to do an artist like this. And to take on board a wild card recommendation and try a new genre, you know, that was a risk. But then I really enjoyed this artist and I really enjoyed Ronnie. I really enjoyed the band. So to have him now react to it and to say that he appreciated it and that he liked me, that that's awesome, man. That's that's when hard work pays off. So huge shout out to Ronnie. Huge shout out to Falling in Reverse and Popular Monster. If you guys haven't seen the full reaction, I'll put the links below. I will also put the link to his song. Also, if you have more requests from Popular Monster, <clears throat> from Popular Monster, what am I doing? My, my brain's fried now. If you have more requests from Falling in Reverse, then comment it down below. We're definitely going to do some more. We're going to check out more. As always, guys, this is your reminder to stay safe, to stay positive. If you need anything at all, reach out to me. Reach out to the community. Thank you. As always, I love you. I'll catch you in the next video. I'm out.